probably remember us from Friday night when Brian got up here and said, I want to buy a team, and then I want to do something awesome. Is anyone else crazy enough to do that with me? So we ended up getting that in the form of three awesome developers, Gabriel, Brian, and Volker, two awesome business people, Shashi, Kyle, and Jordan, that's three, sorry, can't have, uh, and I'm Ellen, and I was on design, and I want you to share dinner with me. So here's the problem. You go and you want to plan a dinner party, but as Vishwa told us, we have to manage the invitation through Evite or Facebook, and then you have to figure out your entertainment through some other service provider like Netflix, and then you have to go figure out the food and who's going to make what and who's going to do what. So it kind of just ends up being a pain. By the time you just this event, it's supposed to be fun, social, healthy, awesome. You actually kind of just feel like, oh, why did I bother doing this anyway? So what Share Dinner with Me tries to do is put that all in one place and make it easy for you. You go in, you sign up, pick a date, plan your menu. We pull down ingredients for you based on what you say you want to make and scale them appropriately how many people are RCB. You invite your friends, you order the food through one of our partners, such as Amazon Fresh, Pecan, or Safeway, and then pretty much that's all you have to do. Uh, so the cool part, Brian's going to do a demo right after. We've heard that you want to use this, but Sachin told us, good for potlucks. Maris told us, good for barbecues. And Justin would definitely use it. <laughs> <laughs> So we really want to focus on removing the pain point of actually organizing and kind of facilitating the event. So the tech side, sorry, tech side itself, like I said, we wanted to give you just enough of what you, could, what you needed to actually do this kind of event. So we wanted to remove as much as possible all the distractions, so we, we kind of stripped more features away than we actually put in. So one of our core fe our features was this kind of detailed page about the event itself, everything you need to know to get going. You've got down here in the bottom right who's actually coming, who's you know who's in already, who's kind of on the fence already. You also have your initial kind of uh, so we have this margarita party here right, right now. We have this initial me menu items of a margarita and the kidney pancake, which are very popular. Um, we're going to go over to the kind of picking the actual items here in our in our event here. We have the margarita, like I said before. We also spent a lot of time kind of working on UI elements that would make that really easy really kind of uh, smooth and remove those pain points again too. So this will give you basically your ingredients list and eventually generate a shopping list for you to kind of go with or import something like Amazon Fresh itself. So what kind of market is this? Okay. So 112 million households in the United States. Not very exciting. This was hard to find, but each of those households has 11.4 events per year. So that's like one a month. If you think about it, you probably have about one a month too. So that's 1.25 billion parties we could be helping. We're not really expecting to get all of those. But we're going to start out by having some manager parties. Each of us is committed to forcing one of our friends to have a party every week for the rest of the summer. And we'll do it through our service, and they're going to do that. We're also going to use that research we find out from having those parties to write some content up about how can you have an awesome dinner party? What are the common things you should be worried about? And use that content to draw more users into our site. Uh, thanks to Kate for helping us come up with that. Um, and then also we'll do standard press release to dinner and cooking blogs, trying to get more people engaged in the community excited about this. And so we extremely targeted online advertising. Facebook actually lets us target people who are interested in hosting dinner parties. Exactly what we want. Okay. So, how are we making money? As we said, we're going to partner with delivery grocery services. So the first time use referral fee for Safeway or Peabody is $25. But we don't really want to only make money the first time you have a party. So what we're also going to do is start helping you with other things. We're going to have the kind of checklist like, oh, it's a week before the party. Do you have enough wine glasses? Not everyone always has eight wine glasses at home. Or the day before the party, maybe you want to order some flowers to make your house look a little nicer when you have your guests over. And using that, we can take advantage of the Amazon affiliate program and other affiliate programs to get about 48% of that revenue every time. We can also sell targeted advertisements on our own site since we have such a specific user base of people who are having dinner parties. Okay, so that's where we're at now. We also have some stuff we want to expand into. On the product side, we want to take advantage of meal planning as well as just inviting people. So how can you plan together, each of you suggesting different kinds of food, maybe you can put in your allergies ahead of time and work on that coordination. <laughs> we want to have a mobile application that lets you plan and set the alarms when you're cooking things. So that way you'll know, okay, turkey goes in the oven now, cook the green beans while the turkey's in the oven, know when to take the turkey out, not make any mistakes in cooking, make everything go smoothly. We're thinking about connecting with online invitation sites instead of having our own, referring to catering companies and party planners for events too large for us to handle at home. And we're hoping by doing that, we'll tap into more of the $794 million people spend on food for household parties every year. So thanks for listening, and I want you to share dinner with me. And more appropriately, we're going out drinking after this, and you should all come with us. <laughs>